Ohm's law is based on the fact that electricity behaves like a fluid or gas flowing through pipes. Ohm's law states that current equals voltage divided by resistance, or it is sometimes said that amps equals volts divided by ohms. This formula will let you calculate current flowing through something if you know the voltage across it and the resistance across it. Rearranging Ohm's law formula gives a formula for voltage. Voltage equals current multiplied by resistance. Or you could say that volts equals amps multiplied by ohms. This formula will let you calculate the voltage across something if you know the current flowing through it and the resistance of it. Rearranging the formula again gives a formula for resistance. Resistance equals voltage divided by current. Or you could say that ohms equals volts divided by amps. This formula will let you calculate the resistance of something if you know the voltage across it and the current flowing through it. Let's take an example. Here is a circuit problem. What is the current in this circuit? Ohm's law says that current equals voltage divided by resistance. So we take the voltage 72 volts divided by the resistance 12 ohms and we get 6 amperes. Here is another problem. We want to find the resistance so we use Ohm's law again. Current equals voltage divided by resistance. In this next problem, we want to find the voltage, so we use Ohm's law again. Voltage equals current multiplied by resistance. In this circuit problem, we want to find the voltage again. We use Ohm's law. Voltage equals current multiplied by resistance. Here we want to find the current. Again we use Ohm's law. Current equals voltage divided by resistance. One more example. We want to find the resistance in this circuit. Again, we use Ohm's law. Resistance equals voltage divided by current. We have employed Ohm's law to analyze several simple circuits. Later, we will apply Ohm's law to more complex circuits, such as series circuits and parallel circuits.